Hello everybody. <clears throat> My name is Timothy Trespass, and I am a targeted individual. Uh, it's been a, a little while since I've made a video that had sound, um, and there's been a lot to tell in the last few days of what's going on, but uh, what I wanted to mention was that for like the last week or so, the level of high frequency torture and headaches and sickness and anxiety and and the other stuff has been less and I started feeling a little healthier a little normal like you know and you start to become yourself again and things are easier to do and then Right about the time where we managed to convince the bad landlord people to put on the electricity for us for a week so we could keep looking for a place to live, then they started with the high frequency again and the headaches and the nausea and the almost vomiting and the anxiety and sickness and feeling like you know, you're dying from a flu or something. And the headaches, the headaches are just the fucking worst. The headaches are unbelievable. And completely incapacitating. And, oh God, it's so horrible. I can't even, I can't even smoke a cigarette. It makes me throw up. And I have all of these all of these numbers, I can't even see them here, all of these papers, all of these many, many, I don't know if you can see them all, but each one of these things is a, is a room for rent, rent room, room offer for rent, rent room, room for rent, rent for room, room for rent, room for rent. Room for rent. Room for rent. Room for rent. Room these numbers on uh, on Friday uh, probably half of them were already dead on Friday anyway they've been rented and uh, I haven't called any of them yet <clears throat> because they started with this crap again and it's so hard sometimes but I don't have any choice I have to just do this um, you know but when you're sick and it, it, it's really, what am I trying to say? When these people use their technology to make you sick, and you know it, and they know it, and the rest of the world just thinks you're sick or broken or stupid or on drugs or whatever they think, crazy. And uh, yeah. your memory's yeah. failing you. And you become disabled, you know, okay. except that nobody t takes me seriously about it, you know, I don't get any uh, dispensation, you know, there's no, uh, there's no uh, boy scouts to help me cross the street, uh, the landlords aren't nicer to me because I'm sick, you know, it's like, I don't even want to tell people that I'm sick for fear they don't want to rent to me. They're already looking at me like, uh, you know, what the fuck happened to you? So, I know I'm not making a whole lot of sense here. For me, the difficult, it's difficult accepting 
being broken, you know? It's difficult accepting. And I know that's probably true for everyone who goes through traumatic injury or accident or stroke or, you know, loss of limb or, or anything else. It's difficult to accept the changes, you know? Aging. Running when they stop in the war. You know, that's a horrible thing to have seen. And not to depress you for a lifetime.